Without their presence, we wouldn't have received this uh, family support. Our white community, our community in many consists of processing, farming, and great companies. When this project was implemented in my community, these are the impacts we witnessed. Number one is eating fish meal. Uh, as islanders, we mainly eat fish and we love our coconut. So it's always rice, cassava, and fish. We never thought of uh, having fish meal. Yeah? So once again, I'm very thankful to the sponsors that uh, we could uh, get it as a mother. We could get this kind of uh, thing to learn into our community, yeah? so we can have our children. Uh, the uh, the uh, I believe that uh, now in our community, most of the households are having um, meat and fish with vegetables. So I believe the children are now having nutritious meals, yeah? Mm, two, now we still can have vegetables even though the um, rising sea level in our community has uh, been going, has been ongoing for the past few years. As, um, Young community leader for our community and uh, Nasi Khan, which is a uh, villageness. I have seen the reduction of uh, sicknesses in our young children. I believe this is because of the um, consuming of uh, vegetables that uh, we are using in our food food. Uh, fourth is our different ethnicity. Before we used to work in isolation, there is uh, like, uh, for example, we used to work together and the work together and the work together. After the installation of uh, food cubes, we came together as a community. And I'm uh, really thankful for that. Uh, Um, this is the first support I've uh, ever remembered all my life in my community. That's why it's um, it's very humbling to me that um, an organization can come into our community to see what we are going through. And once again, we fed with another agriculture. Thank you. Uh, our only major concern in our community is uh, our soil is very acidic. That's from the Ministry of Agriculture's uh, analysis. And the second one is um, there is no good soil for us to mix with our, our compost in order to grow our veggies. Yeah? Uh, just to elaborate more from the Kilikali community, the settlement is usually ignored due to land issues. And we, uh, on behalf of their team of defending DFAT, uh, Ministry of Agriculture, and we can learn for thinking of them. They have learned to conduct seed uh, extraction. Yes. Compost using uh, feather crops and intercropping. 
with uh, accounts for futures, it opens the doors for opportunity for other government ministries to support them. We they also find their own ways to grow their own seedlings in, the, in their kilts, food kilts before transplanting to their own backyards or containers. Since uh, they ran out of seeds, they started to grow traditional uh, and nutritious food on the kilts like moamba or kumbua, as known in Fiji. Uh, the only concern is uh, it is a new idea, so we, they, as a committee, always encourage their community members not to leave their food kids bare, but to keep planting on it. Thank you.